So it has been a really long two days of filming, but finally I got a result that I've been wanting. We finally got my iPhone 6S jailbroken. Now I think this iPhone 6S looks even better and is kind of what I'm hoping for with iOS 18. I mean, these new icons look absolutely fantastic. I'll throw up some B-roll now, these icons. They look absolutely fantastic. It makes the phone just look modern. You know, having some, you know, sort of 3D, but sort of not design kind of helps the iPhone, I think, and it makes it look fantastic. Now, I'm gonna be showing you the process on how I did this. I'm warning you, there is a lot of pushes that I've had to go through and, you know, filter through, make sure it all works. And as you can see, the code behind me is everything I had to do to be able to get this to work. But it's been a really fun time doing it. Now, I will say that a lot of the process is number one changed and it is really strange not using Cydia. Like Cydia was what everyone kind of used to get tweaks and now it's just not that. And it's, um, it's interesting, it's definitely different now. But yeah, here's the really painful process of me jailbreaking my iPhone. I just want to apologize for this video being kind of cut together. A lot of the clips I had have kind of, you know, not gone well together just where I spent hours doing this, and you know, kind of doing this over time. So these are the best clips I got. And also, you know, I didn't really show much of the jailbreaking process or many tweaks just because I'm still installing all the tweaks now, but I just wanted to show you the process. I've spent hours trying to do this. I finally think I've got the method that's gonna to work to be able to jailbreak this device. I've got hours worth of footage that will probably be, you know, sprinkled in throughout the video, probably before this bit. Um, yeah, let's let's try and do this because this has taken way too long. So I need to unplug and replug the device and after Checkmate appears in the logs. So as soon as Checkmate appears, I've got to unplug and plug it back in because I'm an Apple Silicon Mac user and that's what I've got to do. I then click enter. Three, two, one. Oh God, I did that right. I did that right, please work, please work. How am I even meant to do it that quickly? Oh my God, okay, no, what the heck? <laughs> okay, that's interesting. Yeah, let all these pop-ups come up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let all that come up. All right, I'm ready. Three, two, one. Enter. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my goodness me, it's actually doing it. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's doing it. Finally. Oh my goodness. I don't think you understand. I don't think you understand how long this took to get to this point. Oh my goodness me. Look at that. That is glorious. Glorious. Okay. I, I, I appear. I appear to have made progress. There we go. Look at that. We've now got iPhone. <laughs> We've now got iPhone 10 gestures working on an iPhone 6s. How cool is that? Now another one that I also uh, saw was Circle apps. Now I I don't know how this is gonna look. So we're gonna respring this, and we're gonna see how this looks. Okay. What's this? What what is that? What is this along the side? What the heck is this? Okay, and so let's see. What do we have? Whoa, that is, I love that, man. Um, so we've got animate fresh views will cause new tables to animate. Huber. Uh, red, ooh. Oh, I don't know if it's gonna work with the, um, 
Yeah, no, I don't know if it's going to work with the other tweak. Uh, double tap to... Yeah, uh... Ah, right, I need to... What happens if I respring? But also, our theme. I don't think that installed. So yeah, as you can see, it was a long process, but we got there in the end, and you can see me installing a couple tweaks. Obviously, at that point, I hadn't installed all the tweaks. I kind of wanted to just cut off camera and install the tweaks. It's been a really long two days of trying to film this because everything just kept going wrong. It wasn't working. I didn't really. I wasn't reading some of the instructions properly, and it just it did not help. So yeah, definitely uh, number one, read the instructions, and number two, I. It, it was a really long day of filming. Um, but yeah, I think if you're considering jailbreaking an old iPhone, it just brings a new lease of life into this phone now. Like this phone was originally doing nothing and now it's just a phone I'm gonna mess around with. It's kind of, it, it just reminds me of Android. I can do anything I want to it and it is super, super fun. Now, yeah, tell me your suggestions down below of any tweaks you have and that you know of that you think are really good. And I'll see if I can install them. Now, my favorite one has to be the iPhone 10 gestures. On here like just being able to do iPhone 10 gestures is so much better than having to use the home button every time because obviously I use my iPhone 14 Pro Max every single day and it is so much better to have the gestures than using the home button um, but yeah if you did enjoy this video please make sure to like and subscribe it's been Harry I'm out peace